The Dawn Run Maiden Hurdle is next then, two miles and three furlongs. Ah, the top one is Cavalryman for Willie Mullins, Christopher's Burner and Goodnight Naples for Ryan Costello, Ice Lock for Obi Wan, Lexington Performer and Portland Mirrored for Vinnie Gerard, Karuga Blank for Thomas Rogers, Lavender Blue for David Hooley, Mandrake Root for Martin Needham, Parabolica for Paul Rhodes, Penelope Pitstop and Teasel Bing for David Robertson. So 12 then, facing the starter. And away they go. Mandrake Root, just about the first to show from Ice Lock. As they make their way down towards the first of the ten obstacles that they've got to negotiate. Ice Lock has now gone on from Lavender Blue in second, and they get to the first flight. And over that they all go with the grey Christopher's Burner. The back marker, so a mixture of newcomers and horses that have been around for the last six weeks in this one. And Lavender Blue. On the outside of Ice Lock are the leading pair, and they're about four lengths clear of Mandrake Root and Parabolica. And tucked in behind that one, Cavalryman, and then Teasel Bing. And that one's inside Goodnight Naples as they get to the second. Which they're all safely over. The one strutting out the back a little bit is Christopher's Burner. And it's Lavender Blue. Who leads by about three quarters of a length to Ice Lock in second, and then Mandrake Root third and Parabolica four as they get over flight number three. They're all safely over that one. The one that was a little bit untidy was Portland Mirrored. That one's now dropped to the back of the main pack as they pass the winning post with the complete circuit to go. And Lavender Blue in the lead on the outside of Ice Lock. And a gap. That's a bit of Let's look at the grass there. Cameraman fell off his perch as they get over number four. And Lavender Blue on the outside of Ice Lock. The gap of five lengths to Mandrake Root and then the grey Parabolica in fourth. That's the two greys in this one. The second grey Christopher's Burner is out of shot. But Lavender Blue is a nick to the good over Ice Lock as they get over that fifth one. And Ice Lock made a mistake and has now been joined by Mandrake Root on that one's outside. So Lavender Blue's got a clear lead then now four. With Mandrake Root, nice lock. Um, folding it out for second. And Parabolica is back in fourth. And the David Robertson pair running together. Teasel Bing and Penelope Pit Stop. With Cavalryman next. And then Lexington Performer and Goodnight Naples. And Karuga Bank and Portland Mirrored. And Christopher's Burner appears to be somewhat detached from the rest of them. As they make their way down towards the next flight, then Lavender Blue. Clearing the lead, Ice Lock going well again now in second. Mandrake Root settled in third. Parabolica running a nice quiet race in fourth as they get over number six. Which they're all safely over and race away from us then. Now they're well inside the final mile. There's Christopher's Burner still going. And Lavender Blue is a length clear of Ice Lock in second, who's two lengths clear of Mandrake Root in third, who's three lengths clear of Parabolica and Teasel Bing and Penelope Pitstop. Then a length of, and then a gap of a couple of lengths to. Lexington performer starting to run on Cavalry Man on the inside of Goodnight Naples. Over the seventh they go. Just three more flights to take now. And these David Robertson horses looking a little bit ominous running as a team, aren't they? What look of it? And they're stalking the lead in three. And that top stable knows how to finish a race. But Ice Lock's gone back into the lead again. Lavender Blue is second. Mandrake Root is third. Then Penelope Pitstop and Teasel Bing and Parabolica. Coming down towards the final three flights then now. And Lavender Blue on the inside of Ice Lock. These two have been disputing the lead pretty much all the way. With Mandrake Root sitting quietly in third. Over the third, last they go. Good jump by Parabolica back in fourth. Penelope Pitstop and Teasel Bing starting to close. Lexington Performer and Portland Mirror trying to run on. But it's still Lavender Blue on the inside. Lavender Blue in the lead from Ice, Ice Lock who's really trying to fight back. Mandrake Root now being collared by Parabolica and Penelope Pitstop. Teasel Bing running on. They're coming down towards the final two flights. And Lavender Blue still in the lead but only by about a nick. To Ice Lock in second. Over that one they go. Better a jump by Lavender Blue gets away from one. Now Parabolica starts to run in third. Mandrake will run on again in fourth, but it's still Lavender Blue going down towards the final furlong and another final flight. And Lavender Blue is two lengths clear of Parabolica and Mandrake Root. Ice Lock is beginning to drop away, but it's Lavender Blue over the final flight. Mandrake Root jumps in better and gets past him. And Mandrake Root takes it up from Lavender Blue in second. Then Teasel Bing and Penelope pitched up and up towards the line. Mandrake Root takes it from Lavender Blue and Penelope pitched up and Teasel Bing and then Parabolica and Ice Lock and the field. We'll trail back to Christopher's Burner and 
lavender blue lead all the way and then got done over the final flight which is heartbreaking when that happens to you but it's mandrake root the winner for martin lead on lavender blue was second for david hooley teasel bing for david robertson was third it was also fourth with penelope pitstock parabolica was fifth for paul roach